Cody. Voila. in that chimney. The day we hit it, wind was crazy strong. Nearly blew me off the building. Hey, Miles. I'm catching up on... Yikes. Kind of a backlog after being away for a few no rest with a Spider-Man? Nope. Speaking of which, I'm not gonna be swinging behind you constantly looking over your shoulder now that I'm back. I trust you. And I have some stuff I should take care of. Like what? Can I help? I need to find a job. Freelancing with the Bugle was great, but I'd like something steady. Have you thought about teaching? You're pretty good at it. <laughs> Honestly, no. Hmm. No. Maybe? I'll think about it. Call you soon. Summer standing here. Should come back more often. Dingo. Castles under that holiday train thing. Gotta move it out the way. Right. Time capsule should be out on those pylons. Finn was fearless hopping off those back in the day. Spider-Man. <sighs> 
Highline wasn't this nice when we hit a capsule in the wall here. And time flies. Hey, you're <laughs> as close without my sister. <laughs> Friendly neighborhoods picked up an unfriendly weapons deal happening nearby. I'm sure that weapons deal is totally legit. But I should check it out anyway. <laughs> Stuff the capsule in one of these pipes. I can't remember which one. There we go. Sneak around those workers to grab that capsule. This week, dig him up next week. Freaking city planners never make up their minds. A ghost. I told you this site was haunted. Got it. Love coming here. Maybe it's a good place to think. in that tree planter. He used to sneak up here to stargaze. Never saw one until the 2016 blackout. Then wow, the sky was full of them. Jackpot. 
FYI, app users reported an assault happening near you. model would have flushed redder than his costume. The classic one, not that ugly new thing. But today, I must also acknowledge that the city is rallying around this youngster and proclaiming him uh, a hero. Uh, with an unstable energy source on the verge of wiping Harlem off the map, this youthful spider reportedly stepped in and saved lives. Or at least that's what his supporters want us to think. The real truth is that none of this would have happened if he hadn't donned a ridiculous suit and started swinging willy-nilly around the city performing reckless acts of violence. Hero? More like zero? Ha! Jared, open up the lines. I want to hear from those who agree with me. Jared? I said open up the lines. What do you mean they're open? Well, something must be wrong. Folks, we're having technical difficulties. Please stand by. Great. Hey, remember those time capsules I told you Finn and I hid? I found them. And... Whew. Talk about a head trip. Yeah, I bet that'd be intense now. I wanted to bury them in Prospect Park, but it was her idea to put them around the city. She always tried to push me out of my comfort zone. What do you think she would have said to you now that you found them? Good job, but I would have found them faster. I like her taking the opportunity to dunk on you. <laughs> That's how she'd want it.
dad and I fell asleep listening to this sound every night when we were kids. It's got a good beat. Okay. Something rhythmic that was around when dad and uncle Aaron were little. Not this way. Something mechanical? Let's get up a help. I love that rhythm, but the court usually clears out at night. gonna find it over here. You don't mind, right? Hmm. Huh. There's a subway line near here. Later, Spidey number two. Too far away. Watch out! Doesn't really have a beat we could use. Spider Man. Sorry, I doubted you. City feels safer than ever. Pretty sure it's behind me. Need to wait for the train to come by. Get close enough to record it. Yeah. Huh. There's a subway line near here. I need a photo Mark for the fan club. probably don't know this, but your dad and I grew up not far from here. Before we moved to Brooklyn in high school. Here in the clatter of the wheels, the speed when the trains turn and stop. Always makes me think of me and your dad's late night talks. Mostly about what we wanted to be when we grew up. I wanted to be a space agent. Dad's dream changed. Doctor, firefighter, social worker. But he always wanted to help me. Yeah, sounds like that. Heads up, Raph escaped these blocked off a street and took hostages. Miles, I did it! I figured it out! How to safely split an atom from the comfort of your own home? That's next on my to-do list. No, speed non -agon. Collision model is updated, projectile physics is fixed, frame rate stabilized. It's awesome now. Which means I can play it? Uh, it still needs textures. Sound effects, music, VO. I'll write the music. I could probably do sound effects too. 
First we improve and design our own spider suit, now we build a mobile game empire? We're unstoppable! Never doubted it. I'm not doing spider things. When I get home, I'll set up a task board, start tracking out sound effects you'll need. Ooh, and sketching out a score. Yeah, woo! Can you feel that? That's me fist bumping you from afar. Later, dude. This is a good one. Me and your dad used to hang around here. Listen while the whole station came alive. That's what you need. Something at the station. Oh, that's good. I think hanging around here is how your dad got the idea to be a cop. I said, man, you're not uptight enough for that job. He wanted to make things better from the inside. Pretty sure he died trying. He did make things better, Dad. And so will I. This one was all your dad's idea. You need something that's always in this park. Quiet on their own. Loud in a group. Loud in a group? Uh... Hmm... something you'd always find here like birds or trees or no no not trees There's a lot of birds around here. Maybe? Probably something you'd always find here. Like birds or trees or... No, no, not trees. Try not just swing into the I think it's back there. It's Boxing Day, and he's leaving. This was way back, before high school. We were hanging in the park one day, and someone dropped a hot dog. You know how that goes. The place was swarming with pigeons. Dad stopped cold. He said, Aaron, man, that's music. Listen. The next day, we were crawling all over Manhattan and looking for beats. Like you are now. I remember the first time they showed me how to sample. Uncle Aaron had the gear. Dad had the ear for music.
Your mom lived here right after college. You know that? She and your dad were dating. Three of us spent a lot of time here. We got used to this soft, steady beat. Soft beat. think that's steady and it's definitely not soft maybe that water tower if it's got a leak and I can get close enough Subtle, but a good beat. Things were good back then. Felt like they'd be good forever. Your mom got her first gig as a teacher. Your dad was new to being a cop. And I just started calling myself proud. I figured we all kept secrets about our jobs. But last time, your dad's job and mine crossed paths too often. Man, Uncle Aaron, if you would have been anything else, my mom and dad would have supported you all the way. MJ's front page are about some Caria. Not while you were swinging, I hope. Uh... Sorry. Scolding mentor mode. Downshifting. What did you think of the article? The article was great. The pictures? Eh. Where did they get this Peter Parker guy? <laughs> I'm sure MJ asks herself that all the time. So how was the trip? Did you have to suit up while you were out there? Nah. Sable handled it like a champ. Her and her wild pack. I mostly got to stand around taking pictures. Sounds like a nice break. As much as a work trip can be. Oh, yeah. Feeling refreshed and ready to do some next-level Spider-Man. And clean out the gutters at my house. <laughs> Being a homeowner is glamorous, let me tell you. Sounds like it. I'll let you go. Talk soon. Times Square. Easy to find someone in the crowd here. Or lose them. Sound you need like an electric current. A current? Could cheat it with venom? Huh. <laughs> nah. The suit is still, so I can't believe you see so many stats in the download of your app. You're not stealing my info. Spider-Man. Watch it. And okay. the verdict? Honestly, uh. uh. electric. Awesome. Taking a break. Uh. I respect that. Yeah, yeah. I can toss this thing like they can toss a pie. And... Not this way. Getting too far away. You want pizza? <laughs> See you later, dude.
Maybe like a billboard or a sign? Train home and Spider Man was in my car. No, no. Spider Man? Not one of the dudes from the house. Okay, okay. So, or I'll start hyperventilating from two. Oh, crap. Go for work. I gotta go fight. Good to see Feast out here. But that sound would drown out the rest of the track. Again. I'll still walk anyway. Let me guess. Was it that? You know it. Look at my care. Not gonna find it over here. What's it like? Okay, I'm bored. Hey! Hey! Wow! Where do you okay. web? So we can sell ad space. Love how alive that feels. After I started calling myself a prop. Met my first client right under the sun. Neon flags hard to miss. And the crowd makes it easy to blend in. She wanted me to steal a painting. I looked across the square and saw your dad looking back at me. Never said anything. Just turned and left me. He didn't know everything, just that I was a thief. That was enough. I think he saw when we were heading long before I did. If he would have tried to act right sooner, he would have forgiven you. I know he would have. Permiso, <laughs> Spider-Man coming through. Voicemail. Number's blocked. Hey, Miles. I know you're gonna hear a lot about me. Things I've done, now that I'm serving time. I cut a plea deal, so it shouldn't be more than two years. But getting out early, it's not why I gave up Krieger. You told me you had to be better. And that meant looking out for other people, even if it cost you something. I don't have a lot of practice. But I'm trying. Thanks, kid. For making me a better man that I could be on my own. Take care out there. Love you, Unc. This sound always feels like someone celebrating. Even when it's just telling time. Your dad thought so too. So we had to include it. A sound that tells time. Okay. That's it. Ringing on the hour. When I hear those bells, I remember the last time I was here. Your dad had just graduated from the police academy. I didn't go to the ceremony, so I met him here after. He bought us milkshakes. It's 
strawberry for him, peanut butter for me. I don't know why I remember that. He said he couldn't cover for me anymore if I got in trouble. I told him I was done with that life. I was lying. He didn't believe me. Why? Or at least pretended to. Man, things got complicated between them. This plaza and the blocks around it are alive with sound. What you're looking for is light, distinct. Light, huh? Okay. That whole Harlem conspiracy. Hey, okay. nice talking to you. Not this way. Something distinctive. Wind chimes. That sounds good. This plaza is where I had my first job. I was fresh out of high school then. Didn't have the gear or the mask. God paid me to mug his boss. Rough him up and take everything in his walk. Your dad found out. He stood under those wind chimes yelling at me for an hour. He never told our folks. He made me promise I'd stop stealing. Yeah. Shocked at my word. You deserve better. I wish you had too. Maybe you and Dad would have stayed close. And you and I would be okay too. On this very special episode, I'm joined by newly elected councilwoman Rio Morales of Park, who has been instrumental in the effort to scale back Roxxon's expansion plans following the revelations that they endangered the workers with their highly unstable energy source, Newfork. Welcome, councilwoman. Thanks for having me, Mr. Jameson. I have to say, I was surprised when you reached out to my office. Our producer, Jared, was insistent that we have you on. Something about needing to broaden our demographics, especially after your recent appearance on another much less popular show. Oh, yeah. Danica Hart was wonderful. My listeners would like to know, how do you plan to bring prosperity to your community? I think I speak for everyone when I say it's an area that has struggled for quite some time. True prosperity isn't brought in from outside by huge faceless corporations. It comes from sustained investment in the people that make our community so special. It's true that folks here have struggled, but that's only because they've lacked advocates in City Hall. I will be their voice. And my hope is with that support, the city and the world will see that we're a vibrant area full of brilliant artists, kind people, and now, even our very own Spider-Man. About that, you are now a publicly elected official. You are obligated to serve according to a constitution, laws, and time-tested ethical requirements, which I'm sure you respect. How can you reconcile that responsibility with your support of a vigilante who isn't bound by any of the same safeguards? Spider-Man is not our enemy. He's a New Yorker like the rest of us, and he's just trying to do what's right. And if you ask me, he couldn't be doing a better job. That doesn't replace my obligations to my community, nor anyone else's who serves in a public role. But I do sleep easier every night knowing that he's out there, helping us all pick up the slack. I'm happy to spend all day arguing why that sleep could easily become a nightmare. 
but we're out of time. And your approval polls are very high. So I'll just say thank you, Councilwoman. Jared will be sending you some lovely parting gifts, including my J. Jonah Java. The decaf substitute, doctors like mine are insisting they're patients of a certain age drink. If you down it fast, you almost believe it's real coffee. Jameson out. Have fun with this one. I had a repeat client I always met here. Got real used to waiting, listening, hearing this sound running on a tight schedule. A sound on a schedule? Sound of something on the schedule. Whoa, alliteration. Fairy horns. That's right. Client I met here used to take the ferry over from Jersey. Working for him was good money. Could have got busted. He's how your dad found out about the problem. Not that it was me, but that a thief was making it big in New York. And your dad volunteered for the case. I could feel him closing in. I had to try and guess which would be worse told him, but he caught me. That'd be me. I... I don't know what I'd do. That can't be the only reason Dad cut him off. Not if he fessed up. It just wasn't Dad. Hey, young blood. You got almost everything you need for the track. You just unlock the spot where you can find the last piece. Hope it works for you. The place where I fought him? Doesn't have the best memories, Uncle Aaron. I'm sure the underground is hanging around here for totally normal, non-criminal reasons. Thank you. 
around is what I signed up for. I should leave a thank you note. Nah. Hey, the underground's messing with a billboard. Just pinged it. Flying into JFK next Tuesday. You mind covering patrol for me? No problem. She's been gone a while, huh? You must be glad she's coming back. Yeah. I'm kind of surprised Sable let her go. MJ's profile opened by calling her cold, calculating, and humorless. <laughs> Lavish praise in Simcaria. They're basically BFFs now. <laughs> now that's a cool team up. Cool and slightly frightening. Okay, see you on Tuesday. Bye. And thanks again. My work here is done.
Brown's got bad methods, but great gear. In criminal news, sounds like there's a weapons deal happening near you. Billboard's been hijacked with the Underground's logo. Very suspicious. Y'all, I want to say that it is a damn good thing we have the new spider -Man. That's right, no censoring. That is how real we're getting. Recently, a woman from Harlem was kidnapped. Before the PDNY had even tracked her as missing, Spider-Man found her. Harlem's going through a rough patch since Roxanne was I hope that having Spider-Man on their side gives them a little hope this holiday season. Listeners, give Spider-Man a shout out for me on your favorite social and donate to Rio Morales' campaign if you're into saving the neighborhood from corporate takeover. And remember, clean your dryer filter after every load. Goodbye. Friendly neighborhoods picked up an unfriendly weapons deal happening nearby. Uh. 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 
Like a little present from the underground. Businesses are the backbone of America. They have no greater champion than J. Jonah James. But they have an enemy. Spider. -Man. Apparently, he's been disrupting their supply chains in Harlem. Here to tell us about it is the proprietor of local restaurant Panaswager. Buenvenidos, Camila. Eh, uh, gracias, Senor Jameson, but there's been a misunderstanding. Spider-Man stopped the punks who were robbing us. I think your producer got confused. He kept wanting to talk to me in Spanish. Don't ask me why. Ugh, Jared's taking a course, which he's clearly gonna fail. But having a Spider-Man in your neighborhood, fighting criminals in the streets, that can't be good for business. Actually, it's great. We got tourists coming in, hoping to see him. And when something gets damaged, my husband fixes it. His name's Jesus. He's a contractor. His business is called, Y'all Need Jesus. Anything gets messed up, he's your guy. <laughs> Thank you. I think we can all use Jesus right about now. Especially Jared, as soon as we cut to commercial. I said cut to commercial. Take your medicine like a man. Roxanne should enjoy the time they have left. Monique, how's it look? Lil's not responding. Someone check on her. Heading over now. guys blocked up a street and took hostages. Spider-Man is going to the crate! Take him and his sticky fingers down! Hey! It's not my fault I have sticky fingers. Underground. 
Gotta be the last one. Upgrade on the ground. Miles, I'm getting a lot of reports of a helicopter out of control. Make something new with this. Hey, got an app report. Civilians being assaulted. That's what you get for harassing people. Thank you so much. Sorry they were messing with you. The underground set up here with anyone noticing? I'm impressed.
That's right, the new Spider-Man. Yo, what doesn't this guy do? Okay, if you have pictures of Spidey cleaning up Beast, send them my way and I'll feature them on the blog. Till next time, remember that a 10 minute nap will give you the energy boost you need. Oh. That we all need, actually. Okay, goodbye. This could be useful. Underground's hiding something here. Spider-Man trying to get on the underground. this. Works for me.
folks, the Feast Centers have had a rough go ever since their founder, Martin Lee, turned out to be the mad bomber known as Mr. Nagel. But I believe in the Feast Centers, because I knew May Parker, the brave woman who literally gave her life to keep them going. So I was distressed to hear the Harlem branch recently suffered a damaging blow. With us is Glory, director of that center. Yeah, thanks. Uh, anyone who wants to donate to the cleanup, check out our website. It's tax deductible. Wonder. I'm donating 10% of my paycheck for this week. Half of Jerry's. Now, I'm hearing Spider-Man may have been responsible for the blood. No way. Someone was responsible, but it wasn't Spider-Man. Not the money. Who benefits from lower property values? And I'm going to stop you there. Because we have a strict policy of not saying anything that will get me sued. Incidentally, I'm pretty sure Spider-Man can't afford it. He wasn't Spider-Man. We're out of... <laughs> Thanks so much for joining us, Gloria. And remember, everyone, if you want to be a real hero, <laughs> not like a certain masked man, donate to Feast. Jared, cut a mic before I end up in the poorhouse. robbing a store. What should I use this for? Rounds up to here. Nobody can stop us now. Not even I hate just standing here. Wish we'd see some real action. Not your lucky day. Sorry.
alive. I'm opening my presents early. Harlem in order to make it cheaper and easier for him to acquire property. All from behind bars! Now you all know my dish taste for conspiracy theories. If there's proof, I will be the first to condemn malfeasance. But until that happens, it is poisonous, irresponsible, and wrong to repeat such baseless and inflammatory claims. That's the kind of behavior I'd expect from someone like Spider-Man! Several people have told me enjoys a destabilized neighborhood himself because it creates more crime and thus more opportunities for him to make himself look good. So let's be careful what we say and stick to the facts. Okay, people. Yeah. I already got plans for this. another crime. Weapons deal. Got a couple ideas on how to use this. Already getting some ideas. make something on are trading shots near you.
good materials. Probably don't want to know. Hey, Gloria. Just checking in. Things all good at feast? Firing on all cylinders. Indoor plumbing truly is a modern miracle. When are you coming in to volunteer, kid? Got coffee that needs pouring. <laughs> good thing I've been practicing my form. You still got a Wednesday afternoon shift? I'm meeting up with Haley that day. Maybe we can both stop by. Ah, kid, I see how it is. Trying to look good for the ladies. I approve. Yeah, I'll keep a spot warm for you both. See you next Wednesday. See you then. Whoa, where'd you come from?
Middle school graduation was bittersweet. Finn went to Midtown High, but I got into Brooklyn Visions. Said we stay in touch, but man, high school's like a whole new world. <laughs> 